So here in this video we are going to see the mechanism of pH meter. This bulb like thing is a sensor having liquid inside. It has in fact two probes. One of them is thin and black maybe you can't see and there is one more probe for the thermometer i think hence it reads the temperature and the ph of the substance it can be set on celsius or fahrenheit after clicking three times it shows the ph value after giving a tap it's set to zero zero here there is a potentiometer to fix the values let's test the ph of the filtered water It's around 7.5 pH, which is not bad. So now let's see what's inside this. It has two button cells to power this meter. Let's remove the circuit. Actually, I don't know how to get the circuit out. I tried to pick it with the tweezer but it don't work. I did the same with the TDS meter and it came out easily. But with this pH meter it has some different mechanism. Maybe there is a screw under this label. Mm, no it has only two switches inside. In fact, these meters are not made to repair, so breaking it is the only option to see inside. I will try not to damage the parts inside so that I can put the things back for further uses. It's still stuck inside. Maybe this clip creating a trouble. Even after removing the clip, it's remain stuck. Maybe this switch is creating a problem. Yes, this is the real culprit. After pushing a bit with the screwdriver it came off and I did the same with the second switch. Finally we got this out. So this is all it has inside. Let's see if the meter still works. Yes, it's still showing the proper value for the temperature, but not sure about the pH. So as you can see, the probes are glued with the case and that's why it's almost impossible to remove the circuit without cutting the case.
okay hope you like this video and sure to subscribe see you in the next video